Hi to everyone and welcome. If you want to build your own landing page or website, definitely this video can be handy for you because in this video I want to provide you with all information that you need to physically build your own landing page or website literally under 30 minutes, under one hour, because it takes not a lot of time to combine everything with a platform that I want to show you. This is one of the most impressive and most powerful projects uh, for 21st century and you can literally build everything that you want there are a lot of templates and you can build everything from scratch so guys i don't want to make this video like one hour long i saw though tutorial videos in uh, youtube and i don't want to waste your time so i'm gonna make this video as short as possible with a maximum value to highlight you uh all the key editing features of this platform. So in the end of this video, you're gonna get an idea of how to build it by yourself. So let's jump straight into the platform. That's how it looks from inside and you need to press create new landing page as we're talking about the landing pages or sites if you wanna build a website, the big one. Uh, and you'll be on the spot with a templates. And there are a lot of different interesting templates that can be handy for any of your business purposes. Now, and here you need to be as specific as possible because uh, it will save you a lot of time of editing. So you can sort, uh, you can sort all those pages, all those templates uh, for page type, like lead capture, incentive sales, uh, and so on, industry, business and marketing education insurance so it's much more faster to uh, it's really faster to find the template and to edit the template but actually if you have the uh, if you have the knowledge about how to edit the templates and how to use the editor you can build everything up really like under one hour. So let's grab this one, th this template, and I'm going to show you all the editing features. And as I promised in the end of this video, you're going to find out how to make it by yourself. So first, you need to give your page a name. It doesn't matter uh, for the moment, but you need to change it after and you need to make it like unique. Uh, it would be great that it would be unique name of your brand, of your business. So guys, this is the editor. We're inside the editor. And what do we have here? Like we have five buttons on the left hand. We have this uh, name uh, of the site here, Lead Matter. Fantastic tool, just great widget that shows how your uh, how your page will convert your visitors to your customers. And this is absolutely insane that you have uh, such tool here. Redo undo buttons preview with a, a mobile version. You can see all the sites that you can build here are mobile responsive, and that's why you need to check how your site is displayed in different types of devices. So let's go to layout. This is simple layout. We have just two sections, uh, and from beginning from the beginning, I want to say that everything is built with a sections with the blocks that goes one for another, one for another. And and you can combine all those, and I'm gonna show it to you just in a couple seconds. Now, so what do we have here? Body and footer. How to add a section. So for example, I want to, uh, I want here to uh, be like uh, about maybe, yeah? Section about. You can add a section straight from this point, you see, between those two. Or you can add a section, you see about, you see the full list of fantastic tools that already pre-built and you just grab it, put it inside your layout and that's pretty it. Or if you didn't find the correct template, you can use the blank template. Uh, let's use this one. And you see, it's all drag and drop. Just dragging it and can drop it down there, for example. All right. We're going back to layout. And we see that we changed the layout, actually. So footer right now is not on the spot. We're grabbing him and putting him down uh, to the bottom. 
blank one we have an about section we don't need this section we can delete it straight from here or or we can delete it straight from here okay both methods are pretty pretty cool and nice uh then let's go to edit the section you see there's a background color and probably uh, it is the color of the entire page let's go to styles yeah page background you see there's a page background we're gonna switch it off all right uh so you can choose the background color or background picture or background video to each strip separately uh, to do that you need to go to edit section settings and here you go here we have the image I'm gonna change this image first and you have a lot of things to play around with uh, so we're talking about the gym let it be like that so you can use your images that you used for previous uh, projects or you can use premium images that you can buy straight here from Shutterstock uh, or you can upload your own media if you have uh, if you have those if you prepared this um, this content I'm gonna use just this picture and I want to show you one impressive thing so you see that text is pretty unreadable right now so we need to use the image color overlay we can go here we can add a color we can choose custom color that we want I like those all those gray colors uh, all shades okay doesn't matter just changing the opacity and you see the girl is still there and right now the text is pretty visible yeah you can read it without an efforts and everything is just pretty cool all right so what do we have next uh, when you hovering over the surface you see that uh, on each element you have this like menu and blue boxes yeah this is a button this is text what can you do with the text just can just double click on it choose it all change the color uh change the size change the spacing a little bit make it bold or make it italic and so on like normal text uh a lot of interesting a lot of interesting tools a lot of fonts and actually a lot of things a lot of settings to play around with not only with the text yeah uh when you hover over the surface you'll see that you have this divider this happens when for example you have uh, this uh, you see two two areas and between them you have the divider so when you're gonna move this divider the sections will change its shape by itself yeah and you don't have uh, such divider between the rows just between the columns okay so here we have two columns and we have a spacer here spacer is the only element without a pencil because you can change the style of the space uh, so let's go on next step I showed you the sections so I'm gonna show you the widgets we press show less and those eight is pretty enough to build everything up everything that you want just dragging and dropping tags here uh you just grab it and drop it video here and button here or uh i want a form to be here okay i want the video to be bigger i want this uh, I want this area with an, uh, with a form be a little bit lower so I'm dropping it here the spacer I'm grabbing it to the shape like here want to make this text in the center want to make this text uh, headline one the color of the text will be black 
here you go it's pretty simple it's pretty easy it's really fast and uh, you see maybe you have not enough space there on the bottom so we go to edit section settings and we're gonna add some space or we can make it less or we can switch to automatic and it will be uh, like that switch to automatically shaped background I don't like this background color I want to use the gray one uh, or I want to add more transparency all right you see our picture uh, is more balanced right now uh, you see that everything is like within one style in gray that's pretty it guys that's pretty it that how it easy really easy and uh, you can handle that by yourself uh, and you can get your landing page or website like under one hour and that's cool news for you because you just need to find the link in the description use that link and get access to this platform and build your own landing page using a template using all those sections that are pre-built already for for any of your purposes but okay let's go i showed you the widgets uh i want to show you styles yeah we saw the page background uh we know how to use that also we have fonts if you have a long layout if you have um a lot of headlines a lot of text uh, and you don't want to change the fonts for each piece of the text for each piece of headline you can switch all fonts uh, here for all the headlines in one place for all the text in one place for all the countdown that we don't have a countdown actually but you can do that also uh, from this spot page width wide uh, and you can change medium, small, large, okay? Uh, so, it's pretty it for styles. Let's go to settings. But before we go to settings, I want to show you uh, one of the most important part of any landing page or website. What's gonna happen? You need to check all the buttons. You need to check all the forms. What's gonna happen when somebody will press the button, like get the free plan? You need to edit click event. You have a couple of options. It's a pop-up, no link option. That means that your button will be switched off. Open a calendar, pop-up, jump to page section, link to landing page, link to external URL. In most cases, it's gonna be the pop-up. So you need to edit the pop-up or create a new. All the styles, all the things, all the um, elements can be reshaped here in edit section settings. But you need to edit integration. And that's what most important. You can switch. Uh, you can get all lead notifications straight to your email box. Or you can add an external service, like more services. And there's impressive list of options that you can use, like convert king, get response, mailchimp, active campaign. All those are pretty fantastic and pretty famous and very powerful tools for email marketing that allows you to make uh, sales on autopilot. And if you don't want to buy them, or you maybe you didn't have the ability to buy them, uh, accounts for one of those. Uh, you can integrate everything with a Zapier and it also will be great like new leads will drop to your Google Sheets just for example uh, so we're going forward fields we can add some fields first name and email is pretty enough do not use more than uh, more than two fields because people are lazy in general and they don't want to fulfill all those forms and probably you are lazy too and you don't want to fulfill all those forms uh, like when somebody say to telling you like give us your email and we're gonna send you a PDF of how to build your landing page and uh, there's first name address second name email oh no I'm not gonna do that yeah that's it so not more than two fields, less fields, more clients. 
and what's gonna happen when somebody will complete the form and will send it to you so in this case we promise to send some workout plan and it can be pdf with a physical pdf with with workout plan with the pictures or uh, maybe some kind of other format but it doesn't matter you can add this lead magnet straight here and you can send file to the human being that completed the form uh, landing page, external URL, default lead pages, thank you page. It's up to you, it's up to your business, it's up to the purpose of your business, but you need to make sure that you have done this work with all those uh, buttons, with all those forms. You see edit integrations, the same thing here. Uh, so it's like part of the pop-up. And that's pretty it, guys. I showed you almost everything. Uh, settings SEO definitely you need to be visible to search engines if not you need to switch this flag on uh, social if you want to share your link to some Facebook or Pinterest or other social media platform just upload an image uh, according to recommendations that gave here analytics if you want to get analytical information and you have uh, Google Analytics tracking ID here you go that's pretty it guys that's pretty it because uh, now on the 20 minutes we have a working site of course I didn't change the tags of course I didn't change the fonts but uh, I hope that you get an idea of how to build it by yourself and you get an idea that everything is pretty simple uh, here on this platform of course uh, there are different types of websites there are different types of businesses uh, and nobody except you can describe your business better so jump to the description panel of this video find the link press that link pass the registration and start building your own uh, website start building your own business right now that's so easy and you'll handle it for sure i hope this was useful i hope you enjoyed and uh it's great to see you here thank you so much have a great day and bye-bye. See you in the next video.